Like you hurrying up would be um, would be uh, for now. What's going on, ladies and gents? Rebo here for T3G and full throttle. <laughs> yeah, what, are you, what, are you, what are you waiting for? Oh, well, you kind of went like, and? <laughs> and? And? And today we're going to do um, this week's very yes. light show listing. Very light. Um, we have two shows. <laughs> yeah. We have the Flash finale, and we have our only remaining ongoing series, iZombie. Well, let's do iZombie first. Sure. Because it's not a finale. Um, I don't know. To me, it... Just felt like another episodic episode. There wasn't. I was hoping there was more going on with um, Blaine. Yeah, yeah. I, I wish there was a little more with that. Okay. Uh, obviously, they figured out that the cops are covering for uh, the one dude. What is that? His name? Blaine. What's the the, the drug dealer? Blaine. Yeah. Oh, it's Blaine. I keep forgetting which one's which. But um, you know, they mentioned that, but there wasn't really story-wise much that was going on. It was definitely more on, well, was, you know, I mean, that she was, was experiencing sadness and then I trying mean, to figure out the murder, so. But, I mean, that's something you have to, you have to show that. You know, yeah, that, no, absolutely. she was definitely forming a big bond with him. Right. So, and he basically sacrificed himself for her. Right. So there's a lot of, a lot of emotions that go into that. So, I, I think it was an okay episode. I think it was pretty, you know... Like a, you know, I would say 6 out of 10, you know, episode. Yeah, and I, the other thing, uh, I like I mentioned last time, I said I didn't want him to do Major where he goes into, like, this psych hospital, and guess what? But guess, but you know what? Major went to a what? psych hospital. But that's, but that's just a plot device, because now he's met this dude who's also seen them. Yeah. So now he's he... thinking, all right, well, because they kind of left it with this air of, well, this guy is just in psycho. I was gonna say, or, like, I, I'm pretty sure that, that, like, the face, something you know, the face he had on was not. Oh, this guy's totally psycho. It's like, but the music uh, they played, I don't know. It yeah, al it almost wants to feel like that's what he's thinking. So, um, yeah, but at the same time, like, it's gonna be real hard for him to say that you know two people are having the same type of delusion. But I mean, he did mention his delusion before this guy talked to him. But he didn't say their eyes were red. He did. No. Oh, did he himself. not? Did he, he said their eyes? He's like they, they, they got all. You know what? It doesn't matter because it's it, it was it wasn't real. Okay. So he like stopped himself. Sure. Uh, but that's the thing. The guy said it. You know, their eyes like red and glowing. Um. So, and the guy said it, which is kind of crazy. But the guy said it. So now we finally have major has heard the word zombie within this context, and I still it's going to be interesting. I still think. Even though Major clearly knows something's going on there, I don't think he's going to think zombies. I don't think he's going to believe this guy like zombies, really, bro. I think he won't believe him right off the bat. Right. But I think he's going to see a few more things and he's going to put two and two together. Sure, and that, that would make sense. That would make sense. Uh, I, yeah, want, I, 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 I want don't, Major to know. Yeah, I, want I, don't, to. I don't want him to figure... I don't, I don't want him to like just jump on this guy's you know mental train right. and believe him right off the bat. But I, I do think he needs to figure it out. Yeah, I mean, and I agree. We need, to, we need to bring him in, and before the end, I swear, before the end of the season, Babineau needs to know. Yeah. The, the detective Babineau needs to know. Absolutely. I am done with this no, job. he does need to know, because obviously, you know, it's, he didn't believe Major when he said he shot him. Right. So if Major finds out, I think definitely uh, the detective should find out as well. Absolutely. So there's no reason for that not because, to Because then... Even if he says, all right, well, this is way too crazy. I'm not going to just start telling the cops. Right. At some point, he's going to need some sort of help. Absolutely. So. Yeah. He, and he's going to want, he's still going to want to protect Liv. Uh, so I, th I think until he sees a pale zombie, he's not going to b just like jump on the, sure. that, he's not going to make that jump that Liv is, you know, a zombie. Yeah. So he's not going to, he's not going to make that jump unless, he, until he sees a pale zombie. Which he wants because everyone else is right. Everybody super works. high regimen to make sure right that they don't... to make sure that nobody knows that they're a zombie. Although this new guy that just turned at the end, we'll see how he plays into he, everything. He might be the first wild one. We, oh, absolutely, bro. Well, unless he unless he feasts. I think he will feast. And I then think he'll he'll, he'll he'll use this he'll use this to his benefit of being a killer dog. I mean, yeah, but I'm saying I, I think I don't know. I, 
So you think he's going to go back to being himself, normal self? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. He'll feast on brains and then he'll become his normal self and uh, he'll use this as a benefit to being a killer. Because it's going to depend. It's going to depend on how far he is from Emil. How That's long true. Because he, he was down all day. Right. But, I mean, he was, like, unconscious. So I think that has to play with it. Possibly. Possibly. Because, I mean, you got to remember, she was unconscious for long enough for them to put her in a body bag. Right. This is true. So. so it, it should be interesting. It should be interesting. I, I don't know. I think I think it could ramp up to be a good season in, yeah. in, in total. Um, I wasn't disappointed like sure. with the episode or anything like that. It was still an enjoyable episode. I just kind of wish it was more with her real story than this episode. Yeah. So, and I definitely didn't want to see Major go like think he's crazy and then go into the crazy bee hospital. But at least, but you know what? For at least I if can they say, play it off he, okay, then maybe I'll be alright. Because when Babino said, "Oh." Um, You've ever heard of 220 or whatever, 270, whatever the code is he, he used. Uh, he said it's involuntary right. psychiatric assistance, right? right. So he's like, like, listen, you get help or I will drag you kicking and sh- screaming. Right, sure. So at least he was like, listen, let me logic some of this. Right. All right, well, logic states that maybe I'm, maybe I'm crazy. Yeah. So I'm going to go. I'm going to talk to some people, get some stuff off my chest yeah. and figure out what's going on. Absolutely. So I think that's... I like that was that that was done. I think a lot better than if they had said, "Hey, man, you are going nuts. We need to put you away." No, I, I mean, it's, I it's not, and it's again, it's voluntary. He's only there well, for a few I will weeks. say, I will say though, they definitely did play it off a little different because he's still is stable. Where, like I was saying, that uh, cop in uh, in Grimm, he was going crazy, but he straight went crazy. Like he was, he was thinking. Like, he's a complete nutcase. He was restrained. Like, he went straight crazy. At least with Major, they're doing it where it's like, okay, I might be losing my mind. Maybe let's let's take this, you know, to another level and let's go ahead and go and see if we can get some help. So, at least they're playing it off where he doesn't completely think he's gone, but at the same time, he feels like he needs help. So, at least that's better. At least he's not, like, restrained because he's just flipped. <laughs> So I'm okay right. with that. So they are playing already a little better, but I hope it doesn't last too long because I really just want them to get past it. It's not something I would want to see, like being trying to like being progressed through this story. It doesn't right. need to be there. It really doesn't. So I agree. But if the, overall, I think it was a good episode. I, think. I agree with you. Six out of ten. Yeah, six out of ten. I think it's a good, good episode. Um. So then let's talk about the Flash, Flash. finale. Listen, um, I will say I will say right now, guys. I wept. Like, the whole last half hour, just bawling. The whole thing with his, like, his conversation with his dad, his like, him seeing his mom, having to, like, look away Are as you she kidding dies. Me? Even, oh, even with... killing Even me. with uh, his other dad, West, uh, what's his first name? Oh, yeah, Joe, my dad. dad. I was oh, like, oh, my oh, God. Oh, even oh. Joe, man. Listen. Best finale I've ever seen. I have to agree, man. I have I, to. I mean, it's been... Listen, I've seen a lot of shows. I would say still... Right I would now, say, this is... I can't say that it was better than any of the Heroes finales, because I remember Heroes... Some of the Heroes finales being pretty good, uh, but but it's been a while since I've seen them. Right, it's been a while but since like, I've seen them, but... This is... De- like, I would say the best finale in the last five years. Oh, my God, man. Best finale in the last five Just years. Just so much Especially happened. the first season finale. So much season happened. One yeah, finale. season one finale. I mean, I think they just... They killed they, it. Like, if they there was an award for season it finales, was, it was Wednesday. It was definitely a moment of, you know, as soon as he jumped into it, get that last shot, which I thought was a little underproduced. The CG could have been better on that I mean, last it could have been a little better, but still. Uh, but as soon as like, they just cut to black, and I was like, no! Yeah. no more! I wanted more. I, was, oh! I wanted more. But and that's, I, that's, that's, I think, is the best kind of uh, finale of even a movie or anything where it just ends, and you're like, no, don't yeah. like, don't take it away from me because it's so good yeah. that you just need, it's like drugs. You needed to know <laughs> what happens next. I need next. that flash, man. I you need needed to flash. know what happens next. Yeah. Yeah. So it's... Honestly, I mean, listen, I can go shot by shot, scene by scene, I, but I really, I don't even need to. I, I mean, love, I love I, the emotional, the, the emotional stuff. Yeah, absolutely, I love the fact that somehow no one logicked like, hey, we got all this cool stuff now. Like, you know, uh, Iris is about to get married. These two just got married, and like, no, 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 totally go back in time, change everything, like. 
We'll be fine. <laughs> no one thought about the fact that he's going to undo all of it. Well, because I think... It was, was like, reset. But at the same time, it was tough for people to accept time travel in general. So them thinking, like, oh, he's going to change everything. It's I think it was just a lot for them to accept. Sure. So I, I'm okay with that because... Sure. Come on, let be, let's be serious. Because that I, was, like, them saying... showed up and he's like, I'm about to go back in time, like... Yeah, yeah, you are, but uh, I don't know what that means. <laughs> like, like um, whereas, whereas I would be like, all right, let's ponder all the possible consequences because this is going to be universe changing. Sure, I mean, like, but that, I, that'd be my approach. But because here's the thing, um, the, the the fact that like because that was really everyone saying like, no, 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 I'm cool with what I've got. Right. Like, I, my I am at the peak potential of my life. <laughs> You just go ahead and wipe the slate. We'll start over, and uh, we'll write a new story. Well, but listen. you know what? I like the fact that I love the fact that he saw himself, and his older self was like, "No, nah, bro." Yeah, yeah. That that was. Like, I think that was. No, I think don't that was. Do it. In my opinion, that was awesome because he was like, he, 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 "Please." He's like, he, uh. he clearly should allow that to happen because everything that's happened is because of that moment. Yeah. So like. But I love the fact that he got to say goodbye to her. That yeah. was just Ooh, man. heart-wrenching. Oh, man. He did heart Listen, uh, uh, it's Grant, I believe, or something like that. His real name. Uh, the Flash. Something like that. Grant Davis? Gustin. Oh. Something like that. Whatever. Um, he did a phenomenal job. He that it. that he emotional with his mom. He killed it. That was, that was, oh, my God. That murdered me, dude. That Listen. was, oh, that just... Kill. I'm not gonna deny, man. There was there was some that tears was coming out. That was man. Um, I was like a five year old girl. Just, <laughs> I'm, I'm okay. So I'm beautiful. okay with admitting that because there was just a lot of emotional stuff going on when he tells Joe Dude. that he's his dad. Like he straight up called him dad. That was oh my god. Uh, that was that was one of those things. Like I have uh, my my dad's an asshole. Long story short, uh, but so like I have a big thing for like powerful father figures in film, and that would just killed me yeah both, like both scenes with his with his dad with his real dad and, and joe and oh man and that. then like watching his dad say run barry run at the end i mean it's just that wasn't barry that wasn't his dad at the end when his dad watches him run to the giant hole in space he says run barry oh run. i missed that yeah. somehow i missed that yeah um, uh it was just i don't know every the as much as i don't want the drama this was like, it was, it like was an perfect, episode. It was, it was like the perfect drama for the episode. Because here's the thing, man. This is the one time this entire season I have liked Eddie. Yeah. Which sucks, because that's like the... He that's, took his I'm gonna, life. I'm going to call that the Nate complex, right? Listen. Because you hated Nate in that entire season of Walking Dead. In the right? second half or whatever. Right? He was and like that last episode he was in, he's like showing potential. He wants to be productive. Cut. Dead. Yeah. So yeah. that killed me. I was like, man, like he's... He's, he's like he apologizing to Iris life. and then just like, bam. And I was like, he went, what? He went and sacrificed himself to just prevent that, this and man just that from last, happening. His last words, that's all I wanted was to be your hero. Oh. Dude, the whole, the whole episode. Woo! The whole I Honestly, there's not one thing that I can complain about in this episode. Not one. No, not really. Not one. Not genuinely. Like I genuinely so, can't like I said, sit the here thing, and badmouth and think The only about thing this I can say is that last shot. Because here's the thing. I love the time travel scene. The yeah. time travel scene was perfect because yeah. it showed you a bunch of the past. Right. Showed you really cool stuff from the future because right. it showed Killer Frost. Right, yeah. Yeah. Uh, it showed a bunch of the stuff from Legends. You did. It showed so that. that was cool. Yeah. You got to see, when the vortex opened up, you got to see... The helmet. Uh, well, you got to see the helmet, but I'm talking about the, when the wormhole opened up at the end, when the black hole opened up, you got... Um, Hot Girl. Hot Girl yeah. was there. You got Captain Cold was there. Like, yeah. everyone, like, got yeah. a shot at it. Yeah. Um, so that was cool. So they really set up a lot of stuff. The only, Like I said, the only thing I could nitpick... And it really is. I mean, listen, it's just that we wanna... last shot. It was clearly CG, and like it could have been done better. But again, the rest of the show so heavily outweighs it that it's really a nitpick. If well, I'm, gonna, that's, if that's I'm like the... pointing it out, is really me saying like, all right, what can I find wrong? In this listen, episode? it's it's one of those things to me where can I sit here and tear apart this show and tear apart that episode? Everybody can. 
But like, I why? See, like with this episode, I don't, I don't even really think I could. But at the same time, why? Was it was it enough that it made you feel this much about an episode? Yeah. It was enough. Why would I want to sit here and like destroy it? Because oh, because even the one scene where he picks up Little Barry and takes out, you can see that thing is like his face is CG. You can see the CG in that shot. But so what? Because they had to make him older. But so what? I don't care. Because this episode was so good, I will not nitpick it. I won't. It was that good. I love it. The best right now because I can't really remember any other season finale. But like the little ones. But like compared, the, the compared to the ones that agents, I can't. Compared to like, oh yeah. Uh, if you compare it to the shows we've been reviewing, the best absolutely. season finale. Absolutely. No question about it. I mean, going back. By far. Trying, like, going back to like trying to think of similar shows that ran more than one season. Um, like Heroes is really the only thing I can think of. And like the season one finale. Uh, it was the explosion. It was the explosion in seeing the future. Honestly, I mean, I can overall remember most of the finales for Walking Dead. I can remember the finales for Arrow. Uh, obviously, Agents wasn't around, but that they've had two season finales so far. And I can easily say... Season one's finale was terrible. Oh, for Agents? Yeah. yeah. Uh, but I can easily say that this finale for Flash trumps any of those. Yeah, absolutely. No question about it. Listen, Walking Dead had some good season finales. This trumps all of them. Yeah, no, the, the the pure raw emotion in this episode, along with the, the action, everything that was going on, how everything played out, like, you really, by the way, you love the drop for vibe? Yeah. That was awesome. Yeah. So he's like, apparently it did affect you. I was he's like, like oh. well, he, yes. well, he even said it. He said, you're connected to the vibration of the universe. Yeah. So he even threw that in there. So uh, I think they might play his powers a little differently. Sure. Um, but I think that's going to be... But regardless... I, I mean, just everything was fantastic. just... Fantastic. Listen, fantastic. I, I said it. I said, last week's episode could have been a season finale. So I was like, I don't even know what they're going to do. They knocked it out of the park. Killed it. They. Killed I mean, it. listen, if last week's could have been a season finale, this week's could have been a series Here, finale. Here, here's the thing, man. Here's the thing. <laughs> uh, I, I do not envy... Because the script's not even done for right. the movie. Yeah. I do not envy... The people that have to work the movie. Yeah, I'm because sorry. You have to, you, the bar is so high so for Flash, high. and if and they're saying they're going to use Barry Allen. So if it's going to be Barry Allen, man, you have got the movie. You have got the, such huge shoes to fill with that. The movie, movie cinematic universe for that character. You have some shoes because people are complaining. Because be, people are going to be dark. Yeah. Well, here's the thing. People were complaining that um, Grant. I want to say it's Grant or whatever. But he, you know, started being Flash, and they right away announced it, and people, even Stephen Amell, got angry that they didn't give him time to enjoy what he's developed on TV as the Flash. But you know what? He has to, he should be proud right now that literally, that the DC Universe has to worry on how they're going to trump what he just did. Yeah. Literally. Even, even in terms of acting, man, here's the thing. Obviously, they've got somebody who's older... Right, they're gonna sure. play a different story, but they're still. probably gonna play that Flash has been around. Yeah, the, of um, course they are. They, I mean, it would only make sense because but here, know, Batman here, v Superman. Here's my problem, right? Batman v Superman should take place like a few years after Man of Steel, but it's not. It should though, because here's the thing: in Man of Steel, everyone was like, "Whoa, what the hell is going on?" Whereas, like, realistically, now you're telling me there was. Uh, Aquaman was around. Cyborg is probably going to become Cyborg in this movie. Okay. And Wonder Woman, potentially first time out. But like Batman, Batman was a thing, clearly. That's For it. a long time. And we're, Superman showed up and they're like, well, this is crazy. We're getting off track. That's, I'm just saying. We're getting they, off track. We're getting off track. I'm saying Barry Allen, it will have been a long, around for a long time and they have huge, huge shoes to fill. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it'd be, it'd be like your, your five-year-old kid trying to put on my shoes. Like, it listen, just doesn't... He's got, listen, you gotta huge, work something around Huge it. props to the people that wrote this episode, the people, the person that directed it, uh, the producers behind it. I mean, everybody... Yeah. Props I, to I, them I, I, because I, this was amazing. And obviously, all the actors. Uh, the actor of, of Joel, I mean, his scene between him and Barry... Like, the emotional scenes, it's just huge. Huge. Uh, the guy playing Eddie and everything that he did in this... I mean, everybody just knocked it out. Iris did a good job. Everybody. Um, 
I mean, the script was fanta- phenomenal. Just yeah. phenomenal. I, I couldn't... I just... I, I did know, not, I will, I did I not will, expect this as a season finale for Flash. I will, I will right buy... Now. I will buy the entire cast and crew of that show, of that episode, drinks anytime. Right. <laughs> like, I will find the money to do that. Right. There's probably 100 people that will... I'm saying... I, but I'm cool. I will buy everybody just a Just for that. Just just because they Come delivered see me. that. Come see me in Chicago. Because they delivered that. I mean, it was just absolutely... I, I Honestly, I can keep going on for this, yeah. but... We, we could sing this, the this praises is, of this This forever, is but... uh, 11 out of 10, so I'm going to yeah. go with that. You know, you can't be more than 100, but this was more than 100. 42. <laughs> right? The answer is 42. Uh, so it's just... Killed it. Just yes. killed it. It's If you haven't watched it... If you haven't watched the series and you've been watching this... I'm sorry. I actually the the game the game uh, GameStop guy said he has to see the show. I'm like, dude, but watch, watch the watch whole it. thing. Watch the whole thing. Uh, but yeah, so That's let's it. do let's do TLDR real yep. quick. So I Zombie, good episode. It, it was could right. have been it, it could have been better, and I hope it gets back like more involved. Yeah, so it was all right. I'm okay with the story. Uh, it, it it could have been more, but I'm I'm okay with it. It was a good episode. Flash, amazing. Single word, fantastic. Phenomenal. Furious. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, uh, that's pretty much that's it. it. Uh, appreciate you guys watching. This is a short one. Um, yeah, I'm thinking we got so many shows next season. We're probably going to have like two different things. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. One we for might, heroes, one for zombies. We might have to split that uh, Because otherwise we'll be here for two hours and uh, no one really wants to sit down on YouTube for two hours. Two hours, yeah. Uh, but anyway, uh, appreciate you guys for watching. If you have any questions, if you have any thoughts on these shows, drop them down below. Um, hit us up on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Uh, Facebook still got that contest going on, so if you get us up to 100 likes, we'll give away those headphones and the router. But as always, I have been Cerebro. Full throttle. Signing off. I want to watch that episode again.